wrote, and if it hardly changed this wicked city, God rest his soul, his copper plate was pretty. project our thought out to the universe. Arthur Stace, curiously, has gone into a kind of eternity because of his word and his act has lived through time, it's passed through time into another manifestation of Sydney, and so he curiously has perhaps achieved eternity. I was invited to be in a start the Sydney University Humanities Society Review. A friend of mine had written this song about uh, the Eternity Man. And I went along and I auditioned with this piece and the director fell off his chair with delight and said, well, no, we want you to be in the review provided you do that song. Um, and so I, I sort of dressed up in a, in a grubby raincoat and uh, a little hat pulled up, not, not as a dirty old man, not at all. I mean, we were aware of the sort of the, the sympathy for the fellow. And I remember I had a, a little brown paper bag because there was the line about, um, I takes me nightly sandwiches, I takes me piece of chalk. And I wandered on stage and uh, I sang the verse and then I got to the chorus and the minute I hit the word eternity, the audience just went bananas. Eternity, eternity. From Bondi to Benalong, Kilara to the harbour, and could he to Karajong. And all my life, this song has plagued me in the nicest possible way. You know, people stop me in the street and say, Excuse me, but aren't you the fellow that used to sing Eternity? Go to parties and people say, Do the Eternity song. The Catholics get leave to use the pill. in the paper there was a picture of him and there was one in in which he was photographed and he said i went to church last week and uh, i was able to whip in a few eternities all of a sudden the press started when the energy of the